Let us come together before God in prayer. Let us pray. Composing God, in the raising of your hand at the dawn of time, the complexity of creation began its concert. So the stars glimmered and twinkled, keeping the beat through time. The flowers and the grass swayed to the melody of the rushing waters. The song of the blackbird, the voice of the lark. Together their music resounds throughout eternity, intoning everywhere that God is love. Conducting God. Before creation was complete, the final instrument was introduced to the orchestra. Humanity, made in your image, made to know and love you best of all. Made, and all creation was complete. All creation was made good once we, your people, added our own songs to the creation. How wonderful it is to be part of this ballad. A ballad played in response to your love, your love in Trinity, in perfect harmony of Father, Son and Holy Spirit. And yet through the world, the universe and all creation were made in and through your love. We turned away from you. We spoiled the lyrics by singing our own song, playing a tune of our own arrangement. And in doing so, we turned from your love. We placed ourselves and our needs, our desires, our wants, before placing you, God Almighty, at the centre of our lives. We spoiled the lyrics by singing our own song, playing to a tune of our own arrangement, and in so doing, failed to love others as we should. We said they weren't included in your orchestra. We did not love the tune they were called to play. We did not blend our voices to speak out for the lost, the poor and the vulnerable. And your beautiful melody lost its harmony. Teach us, Lord God, once more how to sing your song, your song of love for the whole world. And allow us to know that we are forgiven for straying off key. In and through your risen Son, Jesus Christ our Lord, who taught us to pray together, saying, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, And forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen.